how many people have these little habits to get you down here? Like burning. Burning like to chew gum. No, not chew. Well, I come home one day and I'm really irritated. And I'm looking for a little sympathy. And there's a birdie lying on the couch, drinking a beer and chewing. No, not chewing. So I said to him, I said, Bernie, pop that gum one more time. And he did. So I took the shotgun off the wall and fired two warning shots into his head. He had a gun. He had a gun. He only had himself to blame. If you'd have been there, if you'd have seen it, I bet you, you would have done the same. City about two years ago, and he told me he was single, and we hit it off. So we started living together. He'd go to work, he'd come home from work, I'd mix him a drink, we'd have dinner. Well, that was like heaven in two and a half rooms. And then I found out, single, he told me. Single my ass. Not only was he married, oh no, but he had six wives, one of those Mormons. So you know, that night when he came home, I fixed him his dream as usual. You know, some guys just can't handle their arse stick. He had it coming. He had it coming. He took a flower in its prime, and he used it, and he abused it. Oh, it was murder, but not a crime. for dinner, minding my own business, when in storms my husband with in a jealous rage. You've been screwing the milkman, he says. He was crazy. You've been screwing the milkman. He kept on screaming. You've been screwing the milkman. He ran into my knife. He ran into my knife ten times. If you'd have been there, if you'd have seen it, I bet you you would have done the same. Veronica and I, we, so we did this double act, and my husband, Charlie, he used to travel around with us. Well, now for the last number in our act, we did this 20 acrobatic tricks. Splits, spread eagles, flip flops, one, two, three, four, five, back flips. Well, one night now, we're up at the Cicero, you know, kicking back, and boozing, and drinking, and we run out of ice. So I went out to get some. When I come back and open the door, there's Veronica and Charlie on the floor doing number 17, the spread eagle. Well, I mean, I was in such a state of shock. I, I completely blacked out. I, I can't remember a thing. It, it wasn't until later when I was washing the blood off my hands, I even knew they were dead. They had it coming. They had it coming. They had it coming all along. I didn't do it. But if I'd done it, how could you tell me that I was wrong? Lipschitz. I love Alan Lipschitz more than I can possibly say. He was this real artistic guy. Since then, a painter. He was always trying to find himself. He'd go out every night looking for himself, but along the way he found Ruth, Gladys, Rosemary, and Irving. I guess you could say we broke up for artistic differences. He saw himself alive, and I saw him dead. The dirty bum, bum, bum.
Clementi at Parks Parks Hayward. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and two dogs that are biting people. Now there's something that can only be blamed on the owner. I'm sorry, it's not the breed, it's the owner. What do you think? Because I think she's a little snappy herself, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Princess Anne, I mean, she was the only girl in the family. Oh, yeah. Well, next to Albert, but... Good night, Robert. Good night. Good night, Casey. Good night, Casey.